little too dark. Invite. Ho, ho, ho. Wore my ho, ho, ho earrings just for my special friends to match the ho, ho, ho video they did. It's funny. If you can't laugh at yourself, who are you going to laugh at? Oh, wait, I got plenty of people to laugh at. So I'm out on one of my accounts. Uh, Libby's. Is it Libby's? Yes, Libby Star is out of Facebook jail. I can actually message there now. Till they get me banned again. I can only go live on this one. I can't answer any messages. I cannot reply. I can't post, but I can go live. <laughs> I don't know why, but I'll take it. Echo, volume five. I just love Echo. I'm going to invite some people. This will be hopefully the last video on this account. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells rock. Okay, hold on. Ooh. Is everybody getting ready for Christmas? I am. I've done. Hi, Christina. It's just too dark in here. I got Tony getting all of the uh, Christmas decorations down. I got my Santa Claus apron, the tree. We've got no stocking jets stung by the, hung by the, I can't even talk, hung by the chimney. They're not up yet, but they will be soon. So Merry Christmas, Christina. How I missed everybody. I know I don't get a lot of um, people on this account, but just wait. Tomorrow. I have waited so long. Does anybody else feel the pain when you're in Facebook jail? It's like you're completely cut off from the world. It drives me crazy. So if I'm not answering you, please don't call me an a-hole. Few of you have. I can't answer. And if you really want to, like, get a hold of me, you probably should give me your phone number and exchange real messages. Because that's how I've kept in touch with the people that are close to me. So, I didn't in a one horse. Like, so today, um, I had um, court. And I'm not going to keep uh, t or say anything about it till tomorrow. So, um Lots to catch up on, absolutely. Um, hi, Lorna. I am so tired of people acting like they know what's going on with this case, and they don't. Um, so many people say that I'm gonna lose my kids, but I'm not. Good things happened today. Is it exactly what I wanted? No, but it was a good day. I'm really proud of um, how I took a stand and took up for my kids and what they really needed as an advocate and as a mommy. So tomorrow, make sure that you hop over to Jamie Star Johnson and watch. I don't know exactly what time. I mean, the countdown is literally on. I think it was like seven hours a little bit ago. Um, it's getting cold in there, guys. Look at my cool sweater. How many of you have the ugly sweaters? I actually have my um, ex-roommates, and I don't care who wants to make comments. Oh, she shouldn't be his friend because I had a fight. Ooh. Um, I have his Christmas shirt, and uh, I love it. Oh, hold on. I love it. I have a bunch of Christmas clothes, um, but I love my apron the best. So does everybody have your tree up? Do you have Christmas presents? I ain't got a presents under there. <laughs> wow. Made 
cut all the lights off because they didn't work. But it's a pretty tree this year. My last year's got broken. Do you wanna know where I found that tree? Just guess. Just guess. Everybody wanna make fun of me, but somebody threw that away. 95. Hi, Shara. I love, I don't really care for this one. Echo, next song, please. I love Echo. Love it. I've been playing it all night. <laughs> uh, Tony isn't very fond of it. <laughs> but oh well. It's gonna be a great Christmas for him, too. Um, I announced on my other page that I will be getting married. Shh, I will give you that one. Heads up. So, um, oh, I have my mistletoe too. Hold on. Look what I have. <laughs> Here you go, haters. <laughs> Think that'll work later for Tony? <laughs> I'm, uh, this has been a hard, hard, hard seven, eight months. Um, but I guess when you keep faith, you keep moving forward, no matter what somebody says, whether they call you ho-ho-hos. <laughs> I thought that video was kind of funny. So, or if they want to say they know what's going on, or they want to say what kind of mama you are, what kind of person you are, just stay on track. To all these moms and dads that are going through this, never did I want to be here, but I'm here. And I'm making the best out of it. Um, thank you. Never thought I'd say that again. I know that's going to be the next conversation. Oh my God. She's going to get married again. Yep, sure am. Um, Tony and I are doing great. We uh, have grown a lot in the last couple months and um, my kids love them as much as I do. So tomorrow, I'm gonna get back to him tonight. <gasps> and we'll just leave it at that. Let me get that mistletoe again. And uh, I will be on tomorrow. Gonna update everybody on what's going on, where me and the kids are, what's happened and where we're going. Um, just keep faith. Today I, I feel very good about standing up for who I am, knowing what my kids need. And again, not the perfect solution or turnout, but a pretty good one. Keep me and your, you know, the kids in your prayers. Um, it's still not easy being without them, but I think I might get Christmas with them. Keep our fingers crossed, because I haven't spent a Christmas without them. And um, they're growing up so fast. Before I know it, they'll be like my other two and on their own. Um, not needing mom anymore, so. I'm gonna take advantage of as much time as I have with those little stinky pots. And uh, hopefully I'll get to spend the Christmas with them, get to wake up with them, and that would be the best present ever. So things are going towards the end of the tunnel and I can see the light. And that's something I didn't see um, just a couple months ago. I will. Not only update you, but I'm going to tell a few things, too, about what is going on and what was said and what I'm going to still be fighting for after all this is done. Because I am who I am. Can't change it. And if anybody wants to hate on the ho-ho-ho Jamie, keep hating. Because I'm going to keep loving and keep growing and keep being me. So, I miss you guys all. Make sure that you hop over to Jamie Star Johnson if you're not uh, friends on there. Probably are. And um, we're going to have a great day tomorrow. I am out of jail. I don't like 
jail. I know, because I've just been there, right? Just to let everybody know, I did have a, a continuance on that, and that's gonna be after the holidays too, so thank God I'm gonna fight that as well. All I really hope is that it just stops between whatever's going on with my daughter. Um, I miss her. I have never spent a Christmas without her either, so pray. Um, my daughter is going to be making changes. Hi, PJ. And I'm, after court today, I, I have a little bit more understanding. Am I upset? Yes. Do I wish she would keep the kids? Yes. But she's my daughter, and she has things going on herself. And I'm going to respect that, love her, and just keep praying that this PO will get thrown away, um, that she will come back into my life. Um, I'm doing everything I need to do for me and the kids. Um, again, I'm really proud. I'm really trying hard not to uh, blurt it out because things that happen in court today, when you're stuck in these situations, you can make the best out of it. You really can. It's up to you. But you don't have to bend over backwards. You don't have to cave and you don't have to give away your rights. Um, I was a little disappointed in some things that were said today, but that's okay, because when I come back around, those things will be addressed. I promise you that. But until then, I'm gonna utilize whatever I can from the, the things that they offer. I'm gonna take the parenting. Oh wait, no I'm not, because I got some things changed because I don't need to learn about babies. This department is closed. And I need help with my special needs kits. So, um, the one thing that these people are forgetting is you're supposed to build our families back up. If you're here to help us, then help us. I am not perfect. I am battling with illnesses. I have been in domestic violence situations. I am struggling financially. Hi, Jody. Um, what am I to do? My kids are not neglected. They are not abused. But every mom, every dad, every parent, every grandparent can always use a little bit of oomph behind their parenting, behind their grandparenting. So um, I'm taking advantage of that and I love um, the ladies that I get to do my domestic violence, surviving, um, I can't, it, it's surviving, Beyond the trauma, that's what it is. Um, I have been there. May not be going through it now, but I've been there. Doesn't mean I shouldn't raise my kids. Hi, Josh. Um, I'm gonna take advantage of that, and I'm meeting and learning and building myself up. Um, you're never too old, too good, too perfect to better yourself. Um, I am drug testing, coming back negative, because that's the way it is. Um, but I've had some problems with COVID, getting my assessments for the things that they've piled on. Uh, I have a great relationship with the visit supervisors. And, um, okay, I gotta stop, I gotta stop. I wanna tell you so bad. Just wait, tomorrow you will not be disappointed. Please make sure to tune in. Um, this is a big deal and I want you guys to hear it from me, um, not from somebody else or the fake stories or the haters that want me to lose my kids. It's sad because my kids love me and I love them and we are gonna have our family back. Um, but we're gonna be better, we're gonna be stronger and then we're going to help make a difference in other people's lives. Hi, Bev. Um, they're the best kids ever. Hard, a little spunky, wonder where they get it from. But I wouldn't change a thing. One of the questions that I had to take um, or do in the assessment for parenting was, um, if you had to do it all over again, would you? Absolutely, absolutely. And I wouldn't um, be the person I am today 
unfortunately, if I had not went through this. I think sometimes you go through things to go to where you're gonna go. You have to go on a journey, and this was not ideal. But, like I said, what am I to do? I've cried, I've hurt. I'm, I have been at the lowest point, guys. Losing your children is not okay. So what we have to do is we have to change this system. We have to, we have to reform it. And I have some ideas now. 20 years ago, I went through it, 23, 24, wherever it is now. So I have not had CPS in my life for 20 years. That's a bunch of hogwash. My 18 year old son has never once. And my oldest, after four and a half, I never saw him again until this. So all the haters that brought him in, you know what? I'm sure you're gonna keep doing what you do, but someday, what comes around, goes around, goes around, comes around. So, um, I love all of you. I'm sure they're gonna kick me off with my music. Um, tomorrow, I don't know what time. I think I'm down to six hours, but I will not be on here in six hours. I'm going to um, come back on my main page and I'm gonna tell you guys everything about court. Um, what has happened, where my kids are, what's going on with them, what CPS, DCS, ABC Alphabet agents have put us through, what I've learned. Um, I've learned a lot um, that I never thought I would. There are a lot of good people that really do wanna help our families. So let's empower them. Let's bring them into the leader roles. Let's take every bit of pain that we have went through, are going through, and will go through, and turn it into power. Our nation is hurting, and we need unity, love, support, encouragement to all of those have helped me, encouraged me. Um, people like Bev have been in my life for um, 10 years, 15, 16, 17, I, I don't even know at this point, a long time. My son is 18, so um, hi Heather, another great gal. Um, thank you. Thank you for believing in us, standing beside me and not giving up and not, um, some of you not sugarcoating things and actually telling me how it is. Um, sometimes we need that. I would like to thank my um, Peppa, Steve Peppa Pyatt for, uh, as he always said, being hard on me because he wanted me to, to learn with my heart and my brain. So, um, hi, Rihanna. Hi. Good to see you. Thank you. Um, 20 years. Yeah, I am. Um, still hard to believe that okay I'm old and my kids are getting old but maybe they won't leave home as early as the other ones um, and maybe they will <laughs> they're great kids and I'm really excited for you guys to know what's going on so I hope you all are having great holidays I got the rest of this house in a tree to decorate and I have a new fiance in there that um, I think we need to spend a little time together tonight. So thank you. And I look forward to finally getting it out of what happened today. It's been killing me all day. Things are looking better. And I fully believe that my kids are coming home. Will it be for Christmas? No. But soon. All my love always, forever, and even after that. And as we sign off and every night, every day that I get to see my kids, we don't just give you love, we send you with love. All my love. Bye guys. Happy holidays.